I'm going to have a go at the Guardian's Quiptic crossword. This is their weekly crossword that is a little bit easier. And so if you're new to cryptic crosswords and want to start uh, solving them, I recommend maybe starting with this one. Full disclosure, I did run through the clues last night, uh, but it was too late for me to start recording. But uh, I do have an idea of some of these. Uh, one across little mama gets the smallest portion. Um, little, yeah, it could be L, I suppose. Um, in some form of mama, and I suppose it's going to be the smallest portion. No, not getting that. Um, ripple disturbed 12 outside space center. Well, disturbed suggested a an anagram to me of 12, but that's only six letters and we need seven. However, we have space center. Well, the center of space is an A. So when I combine the A with the 12, um, I saw we have this word wavelet, which I have to admit I'm not familiar with, but uh, I can see that being a small ripple, small wave. All right, let's see. Um, Eddie at Gru, fifth bikini for full bottoms. And uh, yes, when I read some of the clues last night, I have to admit, I uh, giggled at some of them. Uh, uh, so who is the center today is Bartland. Some uh, funny wordings here. Um, so this one, I realized bottoms can mean the last letter of um, of words. So if we start with outgrew and look at our last letters, W-H-I-R-L, um, and I think again, like um, five across, not 100% sure of that definition of an eddy being a whirl, but I suppose, you know, a whirlpool. Um, and so a current could be a whirl. Um, six down, wanton damage made by truck to dismal building. Um, I'm wondering if it could be an anagram of wanton um, and then it, I guess it's some sort of dismal building, uh, you know, carbuncle or something like that might be applied to a, an ugly building, but probably not. Little dog's fur. For scientists' protection, three, four. Well, one dog is a Labrador, and a little version of that is Lab. And so Lab coat would be their fur. Uh, it's funny, I never really think of a Lab coat as being for their protection, um, but I suppose it is. Um, someone posting on social media is Quaint, taking the lead with hesitation. Um, well, we had a clue recently about Twitter and people tweeting. So I think it is Tweeter, where quaint is twee. Um, let's see, taking the lead. Oh, I think it's um, the lead letter of taking is the T and hesitation is er. It is something someone might say when they're hesitating along with um. All right, so 10 across, uh, violently elbowing wife out is contemptible. Well, again, violently would indicate an anagram Elbowing has eight letters, but we're told wife out, so we remove the W. 
And then we have E-L-B-O-I-N-G, and it begins with I. Uh, so ignoble, I think is the anagram. Um, contemptible, is that the right synonym? Ignoble, not sure I'd agree about that. Uh, moving about 30 centimeters. Um, well, I think 30 centimeters is about a foot. And so when uh, something is a foot, you know, I, things are going on, they're moving. Uh, six down now, wanton damage. Uh, I see vandalism. Ah, so van is the truck, and then an anagram of dismal, so dismal building it, or rebuilding it, I suppose. Uh, 15 across, he fought, good boy, in addition to front runners for gold. No, not getting that. Um, let's look at 19 across. Gospel writers' letters. I think that has to be Marx, right? Gospel writer plus an S. And Marx could be letters, I suppose. Again, some of the uh, synonyms they use I don't always agree with, but... Who am I to say? Um, 20 down, it's digitally displayed data, dear. Digitally displayed data. No, not getting that. Uh, second summit attended by those spearheading economic research and Sir Lindsay Hoyle perhaps I don't know who Sir Lindsay Hoyle is uh, unfortunately um, Fred Hoyle I've heard of scientist and writer but um, not Lindsay Hoyle. Um, second can be S. Um, a summit could be a peak. And then spearheading economic research is E and R. So was Lindsay Hoyle Speaker of the House? I'm going to pause and check on that. Uh, yes, he is the current Speaker of the House of Commons. I'm um, surprised to see he's a member of the, or was a member of the Labour Party. Um, I wasn't aware that in the British Parliament, somebody who's not from the ruling party could be the Speaker. Um, anyway, good to know. This should be easy with the K at the end. It stops the flow of dry hair. No, not getting that. She gets to choose electronic reader. She gets to choose. No. Let's um, look at nine across. Subtle differences detected in new, which can be N, blended sauce with hidden name. So blended is another word that should make us think of an anagram. Sauce only has five letters, but if we add in the N from new and another N from name, then we get uh, nuances. Let's see, fewer at sea, follow coast, ending in 
L. No, not getting that. Ease of rent increase. Well, 3, 2 for ease off. I think of let up. And so to rent something is to let it and to increase, I suppose, is to go up. Or you can up something as a verb. All right. So now let's see one down. Aware of Miami's banks, which would be the M and the I, the starting and ending letter of Miami, and primarily Lloyd's absorbing slush fund. Well, I'm thinking of, um, yeah, I think primarily Lloyd's is the L. So could it begin with MI and then Lloyd's L at the end and it absorbs, is it a word for a slush fund? Um, oh, I do see we could have an F-U-L ending and that would leave, so I think if we slush our anagram fund then we get NDFU, and in MIL we get mindful, aware of. That should help little mama gets the smallest portion. Little, um, well, minimum, could that be? The smallest portion is the minimum. Uh, mama is definitely mum. Is mini little? I suppose it is a mini car, yeah. All right. Um, listener to be found in snug right next door. A listener can often be a um, ear. So, uh, yeah, and in, in a snug, in, in a nest. And so right next door is the definition of nearest, I suppose. Colorful, colorful flyer made all the audiences come and watch overtures. Colorful flyer. Uh, so just like the uh, bottoms that we had in five down here, we have overtures, meaning the opening letters. And so if we start with made, we have M-A-C-A-W, which is a colorful bird. Now this one, oh, I can see freewheel fits. And so it's an anagram of fewer and then that leaves heel meaning to follow yeah i think if you do tell a dog to uh, heel it means to follow right and then to coast in the sense of coasting uh, not pedaling don't shoot him for telling you jams weirdly green well, from the letters we have, and then just the phrase, don't shoot him for telling you, would suggest messenger. Now let's try and work it out. Um, I think a jam is a mess, and then weirdly green is an anagram of green, E-N-G-E-R. That should help us with 15 across. He fought, well, I'm looking about and thinking gladiator, and good boy is G for good and lad for boy. In addition to front runners are the first three, are the first letters of in addition to. And then gold is or, I think it's the 
heraldic term, probably from the Latin for gold. All right, so the top half is uh, finished. Let's look at this 14 down. Carbonated sack, S-A-C, reportedly produced by someone like Marie Curie, beginning with P. Well, physicist comes to mind. Oh, yeah, and um, physicist, it sounds like, carbonated sack. Physis I do people say physicist? I don't think. I think, well, I'll have to listen out for it. I think most people would say phys and have a kind of a, is it the schwa sound, physicist? Anyway, uh, it's a bit of fun. 17 across, romantic deception involved no therapy. Well, involved can also be an anagram indicator, so no therapy has nine letters. And we see the Y and the R. So let's try no therapy and shuffle. Oh, almost herpes there. Um, Yeah, nothing uh, coming to me here. And that's almost honey. And then we'd... Yeah, so if it's honey and uh, trap. Oh, yes, a honey trap. Um, often used in espionage, right? Um, software program log out takes time identifying attachment well a software program in crosswords nowadays is often app um, so an attachment an appendix um, no that's too short oh appendage is an attachment i suppose End must be log out, and then a time is age. Yeah, I suppose so. Scenery of country's headland. Well, scenery could be landscape. Oh, yeah, and the land's cape would be a country's headland. Landscape, there we go. Let's try, oh, let's try 17 down. Cries O about ostentatious antics. Well, that has to be an anagram of cries O, beginning with H. And antics plural, so the S is probably at the end. Um, H O H E. I see we have heroics. Are they outrate our ostentatious antics, heroics? Uh, possibly. Let's see, 22 across, a portion of crab bisque for teacher. Well, that's a, obviously a hidden clue, a portion of. And so we have rabbi, meaning teacher, hidden inside. 18 down now, beginning end, something B. That should be pretty easily easy. Utilize a lube nozzle piece in reverse to form dust clouds. Well, here I think we have another hidden clue with the addition of having to go backwards. And since we know we have N and B if we start at the N and nozzle and work backwards, we have nebulae. Nebulae? Nebulae? Anyway, clouds. Uh, 25. 
wife gets poorly beforehand and afterwards, leading to animosity. Well, with the I something L has to be ill, and then W for wife, and then ill again. Uh, we have ill will. 27, he doubts retracted chest muscles twitch. Well, twitch seems to often be tick, which is useful in uh, crosswords. And someone who doubts is a skeptic, which is the pecs reversed, are retracted, and then our tick is our twitch. All right, this has to be lilac, right? Tree sample provided by stuck up botanical illustrator. Well, it's another hidden clue in reverse with the stuck up tells us we have to go backwards. Well, I'm saying lilac is there, starting with the first L in illustrator and working backwards. Is that a, um, a tree sample? I thought lilac was just a, uh, a flower. I've got to pause and check on that. Yeah, sure enough, it is a small tree. All right, so this is proving, of course, it helped that I looked at it, uh, I looked it over last night, but um, I think this is pretty easy compared to uh, some of the daily cryptics. All right, it stops the flow of dry hair. Um, I can see airlock would fit. A lock is hair and air. Oh yeah, to air out your laundry is to dry it, I suppose. Uh, she gets to choose, I'm thinking elector. Um, oh yeah, so I think it's sort of a play on words that an E something is an electronic something, an elector is a reader. All right, 24 down, unrestrained self-indulgence of corrupt peers, well, corrupt telling us to anagram peers, an unrestrained self-indulgence going on a spree, I suppose so. And then this one, it's digitally displayed data, dear. I see read fits. Oops, I did not mean to do that. Read and then read out a readout from a display. And I think what we have to say is that the word dear could be clued as the word read being out or um, misarranged or messed up in some way. So I'm fairly happy with that. So let's, uh, have I filled in everything? Yeah, let's check all. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, that was a very pleasant solve. Um, I liked the surface reading of some of those clues. Uh, so a lot of fun. Hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching and have a great day.